Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I am Rathin Dutta. Today we are studying about or the difference of PSLV and the GSLV used by our space research organization, Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO. So the PSLV stands for Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle and GSLV stands for Geosynchronous Satellite Launch Vehicle. When I say launch vehicle, it simply means the rocket that takes off with certain payload to a certain height. So this PSLV and GSLV are classified based on the altitude it reaches. For lower earth orbit which is also called LEO that is lower earth orbit the PSLV works on that limit or works on that uh, altitude and the GSLV can reach up to 36,000 uh, kilometer altitude so that uh, orbit is called geosynchronous transfer orbit or simply GTO so for the polar orbit it will be lower earth orbit LEO for the geosynchronous orbit this is called as GTO so uh, this PSLV can take load up to 1750 1750 kilogram of payload to that lower earth orbit and this geosynchronous satellite launch vehicle GSLV can take up to uh, 5000 from 2500 to 5000 kilogram of payload to up to 36000 uh, kilometer of altitude these uh, PSLVs are used for uh, remote sensing, monitoring art resources, art imaging and they actually move from pole to pole, pole to pole, from North Pole to South Pole to South Pole to North Pole and they capture images of the art and finally uh, thereby um, it, wh what it does, it takes the uh, onboard high resolution pics and monitors the art resources. And in case of GSLV, it uh, launches um, communication satellites for uh, which is responsible for our uh, radio signals, for TV signals, and all those things. So, in case of PSLVs, uh, if we use a certain example like Chandrayaan One Mars mission and the recent uh, 204 satellite launch by ISRO in the last year. February 25th. All these three the missions are the one where the PSLVs are used. GSLVs are used for higher payloads. And one more thing about the PSLVs, hence uh, since uh, since these are used for uh, lower earth orbit, this lower earth orbit is also called sun synchronous orbit because the reason is that the line the angle between the line joining the center of the earth the satellite and the sun remains the constant hence the lower earth orbit which PSLV uses are also called as uh, uh, sun synchronous uh, orbit okay and the PSLV and, and the GSLV it actually remains at a certain spot at a certain spot in the uh, earth atmosphere or the earth uh, space by maintaining a speed of 3.07 km per second so it maintains the speed of the earth linear speed of the earth so that it can stays at a fixed spot and uh, can transfer signals required for our TV signals for our mobile signals and all those uh, DTH signals and all so to, uh, so this is the simple difference between the PSLV, our Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle and our GSLV, uh, Geosynchronous Satellite Launch Vehicle. Thank you. Thank you so much. Keep subscribing, keep liking and keep sharing. Bye-bye.